If you ever find yourself extremely broke in Tarko, here's what you can do. Grab yourself a full auto PM pistol. By the way, this gun cost me literally 10,000 rubles, with the silencer and the stock. Next, all you need is a headset, some meds, maybe a backpack. Now you're all ready to load into your favorite map. Mine being streets, of course. I wonder how will this raid go, given that my loadout cost just 50,000 rubles plus meds. I've spawned under the Concordia residential complex, but I have no intention on staying here. I head for the nearest exit, but as I do, I hear someone. A jump is usually a good indication that it is a player, not a scout. I prepare myself for a fight with a quick pillow tunnel game, and spot my target just seconds later. I've got my first kill, with just a pistol and some luck, but I stay alert, prepare to fight the squad if there is one. However, all I find is a lonely patrolling scab. What a weird gun he has. I decide not to upgrade my pistol to this monster AK and go loot my kill. He doesn't have much, but I could definitely use some of that sweet class 4 armor. The helmet is damaged unfortunately. My bad. I'm all done here and I need to decide where to go further. I'm walking around the nearby Sparia store as I hear something that attracts my attention. The scow in car dealership has spotted someone. I listen out for any further noises and then head to the dealership. I'm here to get some sweet gear after all. I've heard some steps on metal this way. Could that be a player? Oh shit! I thought I shot the scow in the head. But I guess these scows are built different. Next, I hear someone fighting in the courtyard, followed by a jump over the fence. I expect them to push into the dealership, but instead they run past. I actually have a grenade launcher gun right above me, now that's one interesting idea. But, as always, the AI scouts ruin all the fun. Oh my god, how many are there? I hear a jump and actually catch a glimpse of a player approaching. 
Did you spot him? To add to the confusion, I keep hearing scouts turning around, and I am not sure if they are right outside here or on the top of the roof. I hear distant footsteps of the player running away, and I go outside to try and spot him. Brave move for a PM pistol. After I conclude that he is long gone, I cross the street myself. Suddenly, it sounds like I am being chased. No way, did I actually get him with that? It looks like I sure did. Just a player scout, nothing special. But hey, this sure seems familiar. On my way to extraction there's the factory area, and I want to check the marked room there. It looks like someone has beaten me to it. Why would somebody not pick up a red flare? Well, I'm not going to pass that opportunity for an airdrop. It looks like it's going to drop in a safe area, surrounded by some houses. Overall, not the best airdrop I have seen, and I am disappointed by there not being a bigger bag. But still, we definitely take those. I'm already quite close to my extraction, damaged house. I meet no more trouble and manage to get out safely. Guys, if you enjoyed watching this raid, please leave a like and subscribe for more. I enjoy doing these voiceovers so expect a lot more of them soon. Until next time.